Hazel Oldfield has got a real thing about teeth. In fact, her husband's teeth. They were always his pride and joy until he had them knocked out in an accident, so he now has got a denture. And David drives Hazel absolutely mad by playing around with his teeth. When he's had a drink, he tends to sort of whoosh them up and down and try and stick them out on his lips. Well, they went on Friday night to a disco, and there was David, after a few pints, playing around with his teeth. It annoys Hazel so much that when she gets home and he takes his teeth out so he can eat a kebab, she steals them. Now, he thinks he's lost his teeth. She's still holding on to them. And she wrote to me saying, please phone soon, otherwise I'll just have to give them back to him. As you can now hear, this is a major family conspiracy. 745, this is Julian speaking. Uh, could I speak please to Mr. Eldfield? Who is it? Uh, my name is Rosalind Wilson. Hello, can I help you? Uh, is that Hazel? Yeah. <laughs> it's Noel Edmonds. Have you given them back to him? No. No, I haven't. OK, I've got well, them here still. OK, well uh, t t hang on, just one sec. Are you there? I've got a phone called Rosalind Wilson. No, I've not either. Oh, well done. Sorry to keep you waiting, he's just coming. OK, tell him I'm a policewoman. Hello. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Uh, my name's Sergeant uh, Wilson from the Whitstable Police. Uh, you've lost some teeth, I believe. <laughs> yeah. I have your teeth. Mr. Oldfield, I have them here with me. Have you really? Yes. You left your teeth at the Ivyside Hotel Westgate. That's right. And we have had one hell of a job trying to trace you. Well, we, we rang up the Ivyside about them. Yes. They were picked up by a Mr. Uh, Rogers. He gave them in. Yeah. And we've had quite a job finding you. Yes. You're at um, All Saints Avenue, Margate. That's right. Well, I've got the right Mr. Oldfield, and I have your teeth. Oh, lovely. How are you managing without them? Can't whistle. Sorry? <laughs> I can't whistle. Do you do a lot of whistling, then, normally? This, <laughs> there's, um, there are only two of them. Yes, Not I... Not a full set. I can see that. I can see that. Yeah. Um, how did you lose them, incidentally? I'm just fascinated, because it's... I've been working on this case now for the last, well, what is it, ten days, fortnight. And I'm fascinated as to why there's just the two. <laughs> Sorry? Well, there was only two missing, you know. How did you lose them? Well, I don't really know. Um, one, one minute they were in my mouth and the next minute I'd lost them. No, I meant how did you lose the teeth? Oh, you... I lost them at work. I, I fell over in the ice. Oh, oh, well, fine. Well, I have them. Oh, lovely. And what would you like me to do with them? Well, I'll come and fetch him. Yes, good. Um, could you bring some proof of identity? Yes, certainly. Do you, uh, what, what would you bring? Do you have anything to sort of prove that the teeth are yours? I suppose we could fit them, couldn't we? Yeah. It'll be like Cinderella. If they fit, they must be yours. Yes, true. <laughs> A golden slipper. Right. Have you got my name? Um, yes. You made a note of it, did you? Because it's important that you ask for me when you come and I might not be on duty. Um, it's Roslyn something, is it? No, it's Noel Edmonds. Oh, I'm not even nude. He just about choked on his remaining teeth.